Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So today's video is going to be a lot of time lapsing. So we've already been working. It's lunchtime now actually, and um, we have pretty much finished the gable end of the house, brickwork wise. Um, basically, we've gone as high as we can. We just wait till we get the roof line in and get the rafters in, and then we sort of finish the last few little cuts and stuff that got at the top. Um, but as far as brick laying on the front, we're done now. Um, so we're just shooting up for lunch now. When we come out for lunch, we're gonna hit the right hand side of the extension where the smaller door is. So we're up to lintel height on that side. We're gonna fit the lintel in, and then I think we've probably got about three or four courses of brickwork on top of there. And then we have pretty much finished our brickwork. So um, fingers crossed we get it done today. It all gets done well. Also, let's say a big shout out to Jordan as well. We met today. Um, who passed by and said hello who lives locally thank you and um uh also yeah thank you guys for those who supported the live financially as well so today the guys getting lunch on you guys so we're all getting lunch on you guys so yeah really appreciate that thanks for the support and for the generosity so yeah let's get back to it So we're done for today. Um, we've been a busy day. Really difficult to film. A lot of the angles and stuff where we're working, there's just nowhere to put the camera. We were working on the side of the house and literally right behind us is the street. So I couldn't really get the camera. I'd have to put it across the road for you to see what we were doing. But um, I'll show you what we've done anyway and a couple of things that we have done, just explain what we've done, why we've done it and what our next steps are. Basically, this is the wall area that we did. I mean, Mr. A, we've done that. We did the cavity tray for uh, this door here as well. We've got, got just a few little brick cuts to do on the right hand side here. But you can see we blended that in nicely to uh, the main house. I'll just show you guys what it looks like from across the street. So this is how it ties into the existing house. As you can see, it's a good blend, a good match. And um, yeah, just basically been tubed in to the right hand side of the house. So let's see as well what we've done around the front. We've been doing a little bit of a clearing up, trying to get this space ready for the truck to come. We moved all the bags and stuff of rubbish that we have so we can get a skip through this wall when we cut the wall. All this stuff here is to go in the skip. So we put all that stuff in one place and uh, we've sort of sorted out through all this rubble. And this is what we're gonna get cleared with the, with the grab truck. Um, so this is pretty much now front of the house, which will be the we look out to the garden from the kitchen. You can see we've basically done the stepping up uh, on the top. We stopped just one course short of the um, pad stone because um, we just want to make sure that we get the angles right. Um, but what we do is once we've got all the rafters in, then we can sort of cut these little pieces that go and make sure that they all line up right um, underneath the, the joists. And uh, now from the inside, what we've done inside, here we basically um putting the pad stone up there i'm just zooming for you guys so as you can see the pad stone we've cut that out for the pad stone that's been embedded in and we've set there so once we've got the steel we just need to put the steel slide it right on top of there and the other side of it will sit on that one and um, once we have it in then we will brick around it so that it doesn't move. 
So that's basically what we've done today. So now um, the steel is on order. Um, our guy was not in today, so I got an email from him saying that he's going to get on to it on Saturday. So we're basically going to be now waiting for the steel to come through. Once the steel comes in, fit it in. Within a week, we've got our sort of roof watertight. Um, so what we're going to be doing now, next week, we're going to be down at Wimbledon. Um, starting to do some work inside there while we're waiting for that. So we're just going to knock a couple of days out there quickly and just sort of just sort of start the inside. And then once the roof comes here, we can jump back onto this and get it watertight. So yeah, until uh, the next video, guys. Hope you guys have a great weekend and we'll see you soon. Take care.